Tar Heel State, which becomes the host of this game played here at Keenan Memorial. Before we head down to the field for the coin toss, we'd like to remind you this game is brought to you by Coke Zero. Real Coke taste, zero calories. Enjoy everything. Carolina has been waiting all week for this one. Get ready, folks. The opening kickoff is finally here. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. He's to the 20. Tackle at the 24. So let's see what the offense can do as they come out onto the field. Empty backfield. Quarterback in the gun. Five wide receivers. quickly and he's got his man he's taken down at the 43 yard line excellent play as the quarterback found his receiver for a big game well give credit here to the receiver for finding that seam and coming up with a nice game for the offense there's a strike complete they'll bring him down at the 47 yard line you can tell he's got a lot of faith in his wide receivers even when he's a little bit off target they can pull it in and make something happen He throws left. Great play for the offense and a great call by the offense. But the defense has to change things up. They've got to put more pressure on this quarterback. And they've got all their DBs in there to match up against the five wide set. He passes it. Makes the catch and gets out of bounds. And a nice pick up there. I'll tell you what, the defense gambled a bit here and came with the blitz, and the quarterback showed tremendous poise by making a good read and delivered a nice ball to the open man. Makes a move, and he's in for the touchdown. A short burst for the score. That's what happens when you can win the war in the trenches down near the goal line. And he converts the extra point. So a five-play, 76-yard drive, and they come away with seven points. Brad, how about the guys up front? The offensive line giving the quarterback plenty of time to be able to read the defense and make the right throw. So the score now, 7-0. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The quarterback leads the team out on the field for the first drive. He steps out at the 28-yard line. Steps out of bounds right around the 32-yard line. He's going to try and scramble. And he can't get away from the pressure. Absolutely perfect call by the defensive coordinator. He brought just the right amount of pressure from the right direction, and it seemed to confuse the offense. Riley is back awaiting the punt. He's to the 40. He's got the corner. He makes it out to maybe the 43-yard line. I was really impressed with their last series. They came out with a focus on the passing game, and the offense got the job done. We'll see if they have the same strategy here. Tackle made right around the 48-yard line. Syracuse up seven points. He's into the open field. 
Tackle right around the 38-yard line. You talk about a dual-threat guy. This guy can hurt you in the air or on the ground. He's tackled at the 35-yard line. And he's tackled around the 27-yard line. So the pass is complete for an eight-yard gain and a first down. It's the protection up front that allowed this play to happen. The line controlled the rush, and it gave the quarterback an opportunity to deliver a very nice throw. And the quarterback didn't waste any time getting rid of that one. He took the snap, and he threw it right out there. Sometimes what happens on a false start is a lineman will see movement on the other side of the ball and be coaxed into jumping early. So we'll have first and 15 after the penalty. He's going to be sacked for a loss. Fires out to his receiver. He gets hit out of bounds at about the 31. So they pick up quite a few yards on that play, Kirk. Well, that was an excellent route, and he did a great job of holding on to the football. Syracuse is up seven. Kill, kill, kill. And three, seven. Wants to throw outside. You know, when you feel pressure like that, the worst thing you want to do is just to throw the ball into coverage. He got away with one right there. He's very fortunate. Next time, he should just throw it away out of bounds. Syracuse can make this a two-possession game with this field goal. The kick is up. It's got the distance. And it's good! The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. Sends it sailing downfield. He's to the 20. And down he goes at the 30-yard line. The defense really shut these guys down the last time they had the ball. They've been beaten soundly on both sides of the ball, and we haven't even gotten to the second quarter. Throws to the tailback, incomplete. These guys, especially in the secondary, really get after it and can make life hard for the play callers on the other side of the ball. Second and 10, ball on their own 30. Got a man, watch out here. And he's taken down at about the 49. That one goes for good yardage and a first down. Yeah, that's just a nice gain on second down. Down he goes at the 36. This passing game can be very effective if you don't get enough pressure on the quarterback. They use their personnel well and can be very tough to defend. Caught in a big hit, he stopped in his tracks. First down grab by the receiver. Brought down at about the 11. shot to the tailback and threw his hands. Brad, I think this is the case where the running back started to peek up and think about the defender before he caught the football. You always hear about guys hearing footsteps. I think he heard footsteps there. Didn't allow him to catch the football. Nice 
nice run there. Just throws this one away. It's fourth down. This one should be makeable. And they can make this a one possession game with this kick right here. He gets it up, and it splits the uprights. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. Taken from the three yard line. At the 30. Across midfield. He finally goes down at the 42. Syracuse staff was talking all week long that this offense wanted to get off to a strong start, and they have. They have. They talked about building that momentum early in the game and then trying to be able to hold on into the second half where they've gotten off to a great start so far. The defense was able to keep them out of the end zone on their last possession, but the offense did pick up three. Caught out in the open. And they make the stop at about the 27-yard line. In the shotgun and five wideouts. Kill, kill, kill. Reed, Reed. Reed. He's scrambling. Got an opening. He's taken down around the 15-yard line. The defense has got some of their best pass defenders on the field. They set up in the dime to counter that five wide receiver set. Gets it out in a hurry. Finds his receiver. Touchdown. So they're going to try to determine if the receiver had possession and was inbounds or not. They call it a catch, but the booth signaled down to the referee that they'd like to take another peek at this. Man, as I see this play again, it really looks like he made the correct call on the field. After review of the play, the ruling on the field stands. The ruling on the field will stand. He caught it. The only thing left to say about this play is that was an excellent catch. And he hits the PAT. A short three-play, 43-yard drive. And they put up seven points. The score now, 17-3. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. And he got all of this one. Great kick. They'll bring him down at the 23. Syracuse defense really came to play early in this football game. Well, they've done a good job here early, but you know eventually this offense is going to start clicking. Let's see if this defense can sustain this for the rest of the game. They need to show a little giddy-up now because if they don't start eating into this deficit, they could easily fall out of the game. And he is drilled at the 29. He lets it go. Stays in bounds to make a nice catch. And he's hit immediately. Scrambling around. They'll bring him down at the 40. Now he's scrambling. Tackle made around the 36-yard line. That's a very good effort on the run, but it all came down to the spot. And fortunately for the offense, it gave them what they needed. He's out of bounds around the 34-yard line. That's good. Two yards. That'll make 
Second down at seven coming up here. Ball in the 34. Tries to scramble, but he's sacked. And so it's another third down upcoming here. Throws complete, big loss. Number three takes him down for a loss behind the line. That makes it fourth and long. And they could really put their opponent in bad field position with a good punt here. Little too much leg into that punt. They'll bring it out to the 20. Syracuse showing what we expected them to do today. And this one could get kind of ugly, I think. Yeah, this one's about to get out of hand. I don't know about at your house, but at my house, we have a 21-point rule. And if you get down by 21, we turn it over. Six points and a pretty display of passing was a result of their last drive. Kirk, do you expect the defense to take a different approach here? When this quarterback is on, he is on. It already seems like whatever this defense is trying just isn't working. But maybe if they add just a little bit more pressure, then they might be able to force him into a mistake. They come out on an empty backfield. Wide open, he drops it. From their own 40-yard line. Second down. Mike three, Mike three, red two. He has some room. Zips it to the back. He's hit and taken down. Neal picks up about four yards with a catch. Newsom will be the return man. So this one goes into the end zone, and that'll be a touchback. It's not quite a blowout, but unless they do something here, it might turn into one. around the 24-yard line. And he tackles him hard at the 26-yard line. immediately tackled. He gets rid of this one. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 33. So at the end of one, the Orange lead, 17-3. Welcome back here. We resume action now here in the second quarter. Had his hands on it and dropped it. Fourth down. 
Riley is back deep to return the punt. And he has it on the corner. He makes it to the 35-yard line. You think about the challenges these two teams are facing. On one side, you've got to find a way to keep building on your lead. And on the other side, you've got to find a way to get back in it. He gets it out to about the 47-yard line. He's got it out to his tight end. Tackle around the 43-yard line. That makes it first and 10. Red right two, blue four, blue four, go! He's going right. Even though they didn't sack him, the pressure was still enough to force a bad pass. If you can get in there and disrupt the pocket, then the quarterback is going to have a tougher time getting the ball to his playmakers. They'll line up with five wide receivers. Catches it, and he's looking for more. And they push him out to the 37-yard line. Quarterback all by himself in the backfield with five wideouts. quickly and he's got his man he's tackled around the 33 yard line that makes it fourth and inches. they'll line it up for a very long field goal attempt kicks up and he splits the uprights like they're ready for the kick. Excellent kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Things are on the verge of getting out of hand before we even hit the half. These next few drives are going to go a long way in determining what kind of game this will end up being. And he's hit before he can go anywhere. Receiver incomplete. Short yardage situation here. It's third and one. He goes out of bounds at about the 37 yard line. complete and he's hit right away fires quick out to the receiver and he can't make the grab and here's another third down Pulls down the catch, and he's got room here. Quick throw, and he's got his receiver again. That's a great tackle at the 47. That brings up second and nine. Almost picked off. Nice job getting a hand on that one. Yeah, really good heads up play there to get a hand on the football by the defense. They've looked good so far on third down on this drive. Let's see what happens here. Quick strike and he drops it. That'll bring up fourth and nine. 
In a perfect world, he knocks this kick down inside the 10. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Syracuse offense came out of the gate like gangbusters, but they have slowed things down now. I just don't sense the same energy from this team that we saw early in the game when they just came out. They were ready and they were excited. It seems that they kind of let their foot off the accelerator. And now they're opening up uh, an opportunity for this team to get back into this game and maybe take the lead. Pass incomplete, trying to get it to his receiver. That's just a great play to separate the ball from the receiver. He'll be feeling that hit tomorrow. From their own 20-yard line, second down. And he's tackled at the 26. That's a game of six on the play. That'll bring up third and four. Throws it out, and it falls incomplete. Just flung it out there, and it was short. Uh, he got a little bit lazy here. There's no question he should be able to make that throw nine out of ten times. That was the one time he missed it. Newsom is back awaiting the punt. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. And down he goes at the 36-yard line. It's still only the second quarter. We've got a lot of football left, but I've got to say, this one is teetering on the brink of a blowout. Now he tries to buy some time. He gets sacked on the play. Man, these guys can be aggressive. When you stand back there and take hits like that, you definitely are going to feel it the next day. They find themselves in a hole here after that sack. It's second and long. And down he goes at about the 39-yard line. Play action here. He's going to scramble. And he's taken down at the 39-yard line. Riley, the return man. Brought down at the 28-yard line. Things are on the verge of getting out of hand before we even hit the half. These next few drives are going to go a long way in determining what kind of game this will end up being. Brought down at the 36. That's a team on the way to the That makes it second and two. Kill, kill, kill! Three, nine! Three! That's seven, red, seven! Six. Quick throw out to the receiver, incomplete. So it's third down, and they've got about two yards to go. The quarterback in the gun, empty backfield, five wide receivers in the formation. They looked a little sluggish on that series. I'm curious to see if they pick things up when they get the ball back. Newsom is the deep man awaiting the return. He really got a hold of that one. He makes it out maybe to the 26-yard line. It's still only the second quarter. We've got a lot of football left, but I've got to say, this one is teetering on the brink of a blowout. He steps out right around the 30. this one out to the left. The junior makes the catch. And they make the stop at the 40-yard line. Hey! 
Steps out of bounds at about the 35. That makes it second and six. Big hit. He's going to lose yardage. Number three takes him down for a loss behind the line at the 36 yard line. That'll bring up third and six. Fires quick to an open man. He dropped it. They'll call on the field goal unit. He gets it up, and it sails right on him. No good. Things are on the verge of getting out of hand before we even hit the half. These next few drives are going to go a long way in determining what kind of game this will end up being. He's out of bounds at the 39. run and he's brought down Second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 46. He's going to try and scramble. And they got it. Absolutely perfect call by the defensive coordinator. He brought just the right amount of pressure from the right direction, and it seemed to confuse the offense. for the first and he stops. A loss on that one as he couldn't get past those big linemen. You got that right. They sacrificed their bodies in there and stuffed him. And watch out. They're going to bring the heat right here. This punt goes over the goal line and this will be a touchback. It's still only the second quarter. We've got a lot of football left, but I've got to say, this one is teetering on the brink of a blowout. Nice run there. Pass man open and he dropped it. That'll make it third and five. Third and five. Ball on their own 25. Throws to the tailback incomplete. These special teams have done it before, blocking punts. It looks like they're coming after this one. And he's tackled the 39-yard line. Syracuse has been playing like a well-oiled machine in this first half. And Kirk, are we going to see more of the same in the second? Well, I think as long as they can maintain the proper frame of mind, I think they've got a great shot to be able to pull away and win this game decisively. But the challenge for them will be listening to their coaches at halftime, continuing to play with that same aggressive attitude that they played with in the first half. 
Screen pass. He's got his half back. He gets hit out of bounds at the 41 yard line. It's second down, eight to go. Ball on the 41 yard line. They come out in an empty backfield. Tackle made at midfield. This passing game can be very effective if you don't get enough pressure on the quarterback. They use their personnel well and can be very tough to defend. Throws out and through his hands. Second and 10. Ball on the 50. Catches it, and that's all. The pass good for maybe seven yards. Good decision here. Nice dump off. It's only seven yards, but the offense will take that play every time. And he's tackled after positive yardage. Hey, kill, kill, kill. Black five, black five. That makes it first and ten. Green nine, green nine. Red seven, red seven. Gets it out in a hurry. He almost had it, but it's incomplete. The defense always likes to see a pass broken up, but getting the turnover would have been really big. From the 38-yard line, it's second down. Stays in bounds to make a nice catch. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Watch the run, watch the run, watch the run. Mike three, Mike three. Here we go, here we go, here we go. He's taken down around the 19 yard line. They'll bring him down at the six. So an empty backfield with five wide receivers. He's scrambling. They'll make the sack. And they bring him down for a sack on the play. We played a half of football. Syracuse leads. 20 to 3. We played 30 minutes. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 halftime show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. David Pollock and I here in the studio to break down everything that just happened in your game. Halftime of a game that has been a pass rusher's dream. I lobbied to get the cameras to try to follow these offenses into the locker room. If I had to guess, without benefit of having that camera, I would say that the quarterback is leaning over to the offensive coordinator and going, psst, hey coach, max pro, max protect, all that, I think it'll work. Yeah, we need some extra guys in to, to help keep me upright. And you know, listen, this is, it's always a team thing. I know it sounds silly, but it's not always on the offensive line. I mean. Quarterbacks come up to the line of scrimmage, they see the blitz. Receivers need to know when they're hot. He needs to get the ball out of his hands in a hurry. So the running backs need to work together to pick up the blitz when it comes. And so it's going to be a team effort. But I definitely think it's more, let's get the ball out of my hand a little bit quicker, get it to the playmakers, some quick screens, some quick tunnel passes. And then when you do take those shots that are slow developing, yeah, how about a little max protect, keep it tight into the ball game, keep a running back in the block. So I have time to take a shot down the field. David and I will stay locked in on everything going on in college football. We're going to wrap it up here in the studio. Just about time to get you out to your second half. Brad and Kirk ready with a call. All right, Reese, David, thanks, guys. Just about set to start the third quarter. He really got a hold of that kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Syracuse, the type of team, when you look at them, it looks like their defense sort of just feeds off itself. I think the energy is there, Brad, but I think it really starts up front with their defensive line and their linebackers, the way they're being able to just win the battle at the line of scrimmage. I think it's giving them confidence, and it's allowing them to play more downhill where they can attack this offense. 
Under pressure. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. He's tackled at the 43. He's on the run, and he's level at the 38. That is a loss of five on the play. That will bring up second and 15. Second down, and they've got 15 for the first down. Ball on their own 38. Out of bounds, right around the 38-yard line. Let's it fly. Big catch there as they knock him out of bounds. He's pushed out of bounds at the 28. Yard line. He looked pretty confident that time on the throw. Yeah, good throw in the coverage it looked like, and you're right. He seems well composed, very sure of himself on that play. Looks to him again, complete. And he's tackled at about the nine-yard line. He scrambled, decides to tuck it in, and he's got space. Touchdown, and it ain't over yet. The defense let the quarterback scramble in for the score. The defense had the offense beat there initially. It took a great run to get that in. And he tacks on the extra point. An eight-play, 75-yard drive, and the result, seven points. This quarterback has really demonstrated a tremendous amount of ability and leadership today. I'd be very surprised if he didn't continue to play well. So our score, 20-10. to 10. It's fielded at the two, and he's taken down at the 26-yard line. So you wonder what kind of excitement we'll see this time around. Makes it out to about the 36. Tackle after a decent run up the gut. First down. Black Hill kill. And he carries the ball for a nice game. They come out in a five-wide set. Runs it right. Nice pickup. That makes it first and ten. And he's hit immediately. Pass out to the tight end, but it's incomplete. Third down now, and they need to get it down to the 36. Green 
And he tackles him hard at the 46. Newsom is back deep to return the punt. Looking for the corner. He fields the punt at the 13. Tackle at the 18-yard line. So he managed to get a few yards on the run back. Yeah, but I'll tell you, Brad, with so much traffic in the middle there, it really makes it tough to break free. A touchdown was the end result of their last drive as this offense moved the ball very well with their passing game. I love to watch a quarterback when he can really get into sync with his wide receiver. Fires in a hurry. Interception. Touchdown, Syracuse. Great job here by the defender breaking on the ball and taking it to the house. Man, those pick sixes can really hurt an offense and have a lasting impact. He splits the uprights with the extra point. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. It's going to be interesting now to see if this quarterback can put that last throw behind him. This quarterback needs to be a little bit more careful because this defense is excellent on capitalizing off of mistakes. And he almost has the INT. It's second and ten. Ball on the 25-yard line. Fires out to his wideout, and he's shoved out of bounds at the 34. Tackled after a decent pickup. to the receiver and he can't make the grab so it's second and ten ball on the 39 yard line and he's taken down around the 49 yard line down at the 40. And down he goes at the 37. Can't tack on any yardage. Up the middle for a nice game. Catches it and he's immediately tackled behind the line. That'll bring up second and eleven. This is the eleventh play of this drive. Roger, Roger. Hey, check by forty-six. Check by forty-six. He goes out of bounds at the twenty-three. That's a deep four. That'll bring up 
Finds his man, and they take him down immediately. Brown picks up about five yards on that hookup. Fourth down. They'll line it up for the field goal. The kick is up, and it's through the uprights. North Carolina gets set to kick this one away. And he got all of this one. Great kick. He's to the 20. Gets to about the 24-yard line. For North Carolina, they've been coming after the quarterback all day long. This defense has had success getting after the quarterback. Even with all the pass protection issues, they still have the lead. So they're just about set to get the game going again. Quick strike to the receiver, and they make the stop at the 34-yard line. That brings us second and one. They bring him down in the backfield. They need about three yards to get the first down here on third down. They'll drop him for a loss. Newsom is back to receive. It's away and it's a booming punt. He makes it to the 35 yard line. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. He is drilled at the 48-yard line. Knocked out of bounds, right around the 50. tries to buy some time and he's going to come up with a sack he'll try to knock this punt down inside the 20. Little too much leg into that punt. They'll bring it out to the 20. The defense shut them down on their last drive, forcing a quick punt. Tackle made at the 23-yard line. They keep it on the ground with a tailback, and he hits him hard at the 25.
Brooks middle got his back and they'll bring him down behind the line. is the deep man awaiting the return. Newsom fields it at the 34. He makes it to the 42-yard line. Their last drive broke down and they punted. What do they have in store this time out? If they're going to make a comeback in this game, it's going to have to start now. This offense has to get rolling. Now he's scrambling. Decides to slide. That's three down and one to go. Syracuse is in front by 14. We're just about set to start action here again in the fourth quarter. Gains his way to the 40 yard line. He's at the 30. He's taken down around the 27-yard line. Fires quickly to the tight end. They'll bring him down at the 18. So the offense will move a little bit closer with that penalty. It's first and goal, and they'd love to get into the end zone and make this a game again. Steps out of bounds right around the six-yard line. Only three yards there on the throw. That's a nice completion, but give the defense a lot of credit. They weren't fooled at all. They were able to hold him to a short game. Steps out at the three-yard line. Touchdown, UNC. That is great tough football right there. Getting down to the goal line and just punching it in. He makes the PAT. Looks like they're ready for the kick. He's to the 20. He's knocked out of bounds around the 23-yard line. Both teams realize that when the ball is snapped, we're one play away from a very different ball game. Syracuse up seven points. He's tackled around the 24-yard line. is out to the tailback on the screen. He gets hit out of bounds around the 34-yard line. That's a game of 10 on the play. That makes it first and 10. Mike three, Mike three. Humble, humble, Mike three. And they push him out at the 35-yard line. That brings up second and Go. 
He's pushed out of bounds at the 36. Complete brought down, nothing doing. Doesn't look like he's going to have much time to get rid of this punt. Newsom takes it at the 21. He's tackled at the 31. You know this is a real crucial time in the game. It could still go either way. Tackle at about the 41. He's at midfield. And he's tackled around the 42-yard line. Delivers to the halfback on the screen. goes down quickly. Fires out to his receiver. And he's taken down at about the 25-yard line. Passes to the wide out, and he can't pull it in. Second down, 10 to go. Ball on the 25-yard line. Quick throw, incomplete, one of his receiver. This is the eighth play of this drive. And he throws right away. It's caught first down, and he's out of bounds. Touchdown, Tar Heels. Will be tied with the extra point. And he tacks on the extra point. North Carolina to kick this one off. Riley from the three. They'll bring him down at the 28-yard line. We might have overtime in the back of our minds, but down on the field, that hasn't occurred to anyone. They want to end this thing in regulation. They come out on an empty backfield. Looking for his man, incomplete. Second down, 10 yards to go. Ball on their own 28. He's out of bounds at the 33-yard line. And he's hit immediately. That makes it first and ten. And he 
carries the ball for a nice game. That's a gain of four on the play. That brings him second and five. He's on the run. Gets to around the 42. Gets it out quickly. Brought down at the 30. by the wide out here in the fourth quarter. Second and 10, ball on the 30 yard line. He makes it out to maybe the 30 yard line. They spread the field in the gun with five wide receivers. This one's going deep to the end zone. Missed him. They'll call on the field goal unit here for this long field goal attempt. Kicks away. And he just drilled it from long range. They're ready for the kickoff. He's to the 20, and he's tackled at the 20. Syracuse has been on fire here in the fourth quarter. They could have used some of this in the first three. Yeah, where was this in the first half? It would have given them a chance to be able to win this game and pull away. Now they got to hope that they can make a play late to win it. And as the defense comes back out, you can be sure they're thinking about that score they surrendered the last time around. You know, when this defense went over to the sidelines based on the way they've been playing so far, this defense coordinator has got to be livid. Uh, he's got to get in their face. He's got to challenge them. He's got to get their emotions going. Because when you play defense, it's not just about X's and O's. It's about attitude and playing with a lot of confidence. Throws it into coverage, and it's intercepted. And down he goes at the 36-yard line. And that is an absolutely huge turnover for this defense. They couldn't have picked that off at a better time. Just a horrible decision by the quarterback trying to force that pass, especially at this point in the game. From the 36-yard line, first down. Throws complete, and he's got room to work. And he's shoved out of bounds at the 26-yard line. Let's go, let's go. That makes it first and 10. Just under three to go in regulation. Red two. 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 Caught with room to work. He goes out of bounds around the 21 yard line. That brings him second and five. Five wide. Here's the throw, and I don't think he got anything on that. A quarterback in the gun with five receivers. Tackle after a decent run up the gut. You know that saying, get your keys out because we're on a drive? This offense right now is on a drive. I mean, this is their third first down. They're doing just about anything they want, and they're really starting to wear the psyche of this defense down. And they make the stop at the three. The defense puts an end to the no huddle offense by calling timeout. Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. Diving for extra yardage. So the defense has had enough of the no huddle as they call a timeout. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Touchdown, Syracuse! Well, they know 
exactly what they have to do now. Score, get the ball back, and score again. There's not a lot of time, but if they play efficiently and get a few breaks, it's definitely possible. And he hits the PAT. A seven-play, 36-yard drive, and it results in a touchdown. Brad, I thought that was a textbook drive. I thought they did a really good job of showing balance, mixing the play calling with the run and the pass. Just an overall well-executed touchdown drive. He's to the 20. Brought down at the 24-yard line. And the offense will take the field, and they're certainly hoping to do better than they did on their last drive, which ended with a turnover. Anytime you give the ball away, it's a disappointment. So these guys want to show that they can hang on to it. And he's immediately tackled. Just under two to go in the game. Throws it deep. Almost picked off. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 35-yard line. Catches it, and that's all. it out. Got it. Touchdown, North Carolina. Late in the fourth quarter, one possession game, and this is where poise really takes over. Whoever shows it will win the football game. Here's the extra point to draw within three points. And he converts the extra point. So a four-play, 77-yard drive, and they add seven points to the scoreboard. You know, you always prepare your offense to think that we're going to have some success. These guys got to be coming over the sidelines after touchdown after touchdown saying, man, I, I didn't expect it to be this easy. And down he goes at the 44. Man, hang on to your hats, folks, because both these offenses are in gear right now. Well, the way these guys are executing right now, it could come down to just which defense can come up with one stop. Here we are late in the fourth quarter, and this is what this game has come down to. Every possession's going to count, and this could be the one right here. Tackle made at the 41-yard line. Second down, seven yards to go. Ball on the 41. Under a minute left. They get nice yardage on that run. First down. We should just see the quarterback take a knee right here, winding down the rest of this clock. That's going to do it for this one. Our final score, Syracuse 37, North Carolina 34. That's going to do it for this presentation of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Kirk Street, this is Brad Nessler saying goodbye.